disorder. So, as you can see, it has traveled from almost every country. You know, it's just not from India, it's from like most of the countries. My, I have a Korean neighborhood. A uh, lot of Korean people, uh, uh, I have a lot of Korean neighborhood and they have different rice there too. So, I love Korean food. It is, um, they, they are also like spicy, they eat a lot of spicy. My neighbor, he grows spicy chilies and he would give this part of it uh, every year to us. So yes, uh, it is traveled from every country. Um, now to this, I am going to add the cumin again. Okay? As we said, we are going to use the whole spices. So cumin is the first spice which is going to go in it. Uh, can you see this? Now. Here. Caramelizing now? Yes? So we need to caramelize the onion like this. Okay? So uh, the ones which is like really caramelized, like the reddish in color, I'm just taking it out. We are going to garnish it. Uh, the pulao with it. Can I have like a plate or a bowl? Okay, Do you want to click photo? You can put press this button. Yes. 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 I'm sorry. Okay, so I'm adding um, two or three teaspoons of cumin. I'm adding a lot of cumin to it. We want that cumin to give that kind of aroma, that, that kind of taste to our pulao. As I uh, spoke about it before, I'm going to add the whole spices. Whole spices are the bay leaves. I'm adding like, uh, they are not like a big, big bay leaves, they are small bay leaves, so I'm adding like three. If you have like big ones, add a little less. This is whole uh, black cardamom. Mm. It's whole black cardamom. I'm just going to take off its shell. I'm not throwing the shell off. The shell has the taste too. The shell has the aroma too. I'm just opening it so the seeds can come out in our uh, dish. There is star anise. Later. Just one. And the cinnamon sticks. There are few slugs and black um, pepper. The, 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 full, the whole black pepper corn. Once it's cooked a little, you don't want to boil it again. I'm adding uh, this, this is the frozen peas and frozen carrots. You could add fresh, and you could add cauliflower to it. This is uh, almost like a, uh, like half a cup of it. You, you add any, any, any vegetable of your choice to it. Okay. And 
going to add some salt. Uh, I have taken two cups of uh, full whole basmati rice here. Okay, so I'm going to add three cups of water to it. Three cups of water to it for it to love. We need the full grain. We don't want the grains to be breaking. We don't want sticky rice. So uh, I'm going to add three cups of uh, water to it. Again, the same principle applies here too. It has come just a little bit up above the level, like half a knuckle. Here it's not full knuckle. It's half. So let's two cups of rice and three cups of water. Yes. No nuts allergies, so I'm putting cashews here. Add any uh, choice of nuts here, any choice of um, vegetables here. You could add, um, sometimes my kids like it, I add the meat balls to it, like directly meat balls to it, and they, they are cooked perfectly. I'm adding one, one tablespoon of ginger garlic paste, just one. Uh, the uh, spices have given it enough aroma. The spices have given it enough taste. So we don't want to uh, actually take any uh, or we don't want to overpower any other taste to it. Okay, we are good here. I'm going to put the lid and I'm going to hear one whistle. Just one. No two, no three. Because it is going to become sticky if we go ahead and put that. I mean, if we do like two or three whistles here. As I said before, uh, for instant pot, it is Game just up. six minutes on high and um, natural release. No NPR, no, na uh, I'm sorry, no, no natural release. It's the quick release, the QR. Okay, so let this thing cook. I have the uh, pre-cooked dal with me. Thank you. So what I'm going Thank to you show you guys now is I'm going to give tarka to the pre-cooked rice. As I said, this is dal fry and not dal tarka. Tarka is, I'm going to give like a nice red chili tampering to the pre-cooked dal fry. Whatever we did right now, I did it at home. So I have it in my uh, other pot. So I'm just going to um, mix it together here. Okay. So before we go ahead, do we have any questions for the rice? Yes. We can freeze dal, yes. Um, for rice, I would not freeze it because it will become sticky. Yeah, so dal, put to go. But again, if you thaw it once, use it all. Thaw it like in portions. Yeah, um, I'm sorry, freeze it in portions. Yeah. Are we, are we all here? Yes. Yes? yes? All right. Yeah. Okay, so.
कीर्ति दाल दाल खड़का जी ए एल It's not a grain. Okay, so I'm just turning this off. The rice because it's done. Rice, yes. The rice is done. No. Oh, okay. no. The dal is on this one. The dal is not this. One, one is a smaller pot of cheese. Just a little. This, this recipe. Oh, this this one. This one. Right. Right. This is not the dal. Right. No. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to transfer this into the other pot, and I'm going to put it on the gas. Same thing. That's me. I don't like this. 
That's why everyone's here. Okay guys, can we help ourselves? Here it is. 